morning. This is Cora and I would like to show you and share with you guys how to cook a very authentic kare kare Filipino version. The following ingredients are the following. I have 2 tablespoons of agnato powder to give some coloring on the kare kare. I have 2 noir beef cubes here. I have 10 grams of mamacitas kare kare mix. I have 2 tablespoons of fish sauce or patis. I have half teaspoon of ground black pepper and I have three tablespoon of creamy peanut butter and the secret of it all is I have one big spoon of authentic baguong alamang from the Philippines. And I have here piscina baja na pinalambutan. Pinalambutan ko sa pressure ko here for an hour and a half. I have here the oxtail na pinalambutan ko for an hour. And our vegetables are the following. I have here one big eggplant. I have few flowers of the puso ng saging. I have the puso ng saging here. And I have one onion. And I'm gonna use half of this garlic. Our vegetables are sikaw, pechay, and cabbage. So are you guys ready to try cooking yourself the very authentic kare kare from the Philippines? So stay tuned and I'm going to show you on how to deliciously cook this very authentic Filipino kare kare. Okay, so let's start the cooking. So in a big pot, you have to saute the onions and two spoons of olive oil. And make sure that the onion is fully cooked so the aroma is coming out of the flavor when the onion is caramelized. And then you put your garlic and then you brown the garlic a little bit but don't overcook it just a little bit brown and then you can add your own tail and then make sure you saute this really well in the mixture of the garlic and the onions make sure the flavor goes into the meat then you add your fish sauce and then you add your brown black pepper and then make sure you mix it really well so the flavor is going to the meat. I did not put the uh, piscina ng baka because it's already very soft. So I'm gonna put it last when all the mixture is about to be cooked. So really the secret of a very um, tasty kare kare is the aromatic effect of the ingredients. So make sure that um, when you mix the meat with the sauteed onions and garlic, you have to put the agnato powder and then make sure that you cook the agnato powder and the peanut butter and also the beef nori cubes. If you really would like to make this a little bit sticky, you can add a spoon of cornstarch according to your liking. So I have the rest of the vegetables here in my kare kare. And I already have here the piskinang baka. So I'm just gonna let it simmer for another few minutes. And we'll be ready to be served. So my kare kare is almost done. And this is really very authentic. Because I can only try the kare kare in the Philippines with actually the very tasty ng baka. So I am fortunate enough that I have a friend here in Hawaii that nagkakatay ng mga fresh na baka and baboy. So if you would like to learn more about my authentic recipe, please make sure to subscribe in my YouTube channel. So happy eating and enjoy this authentic Filipino kare-kare.